update. Welcome, folks. We're the Dow Industrials. Finish up 643. NASDAQ up 270. S&P's up 89. Gold. Gold contract down $8. Trade at 1832 an ounce. We had silver up three cents, twenty-one dollars seventy-one cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck, hundred and ten dollars sixty-five cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The ten-year note down eleven ticks, trading one fifteen twenty-six. The thirty-year up down a full point, plus four ticks, at one thirty-three eighteen. We have the ten-year right now yielding three point three zero percent, folks. The high last a few weeks uh, is a three point four seven three. The low. For the last three months is 2.2. Now just check that out. In three months, you went up 50%. 2.2 to 3.4. We we bring this back six months if you want to see something wild. We've gone from 1.4 to 3.4. So you've added two points on, and I believe that would be oh man, a year. No, oh my God. It's 1.1. To 3.4. The low for the last 12 months, folks, is 1.1. Now, let's get over to this dollar. So the dollar is going to be, the dollar right now, the market has a love-hate affair with the dollar. The bottom line is that you can see, you know, the bottom line is that, you know, the first high the dollar made was in uh, May. That, that high was uh, 105. Uh, we go back and we look at the asp aspect, actually, of where Let's take this and look at this for a second, because what you're going to see is that we go back to November. If that's, well, let's see. November, the dollar was trading at 94. Bounced along the bottom. As it bounced along the bottom, you know, market hung up. Uh, Starting in January, guess what? 89, the dollar was in January. Bottom line, markets break, and as they break, the dollar goes from 89 all the way up to 105. So if this dollar is going to break higher and go to 121, you can see there's a direct correlation now. And there's not always a direct correlation, by the way, okay? But the bottom line is that there's certainly a direct correlation now that when the dollar pulls back, the market gets some relief. The dollar goes higher, the market gets slammed. Bottom line, keep your eye on the dollar. Have a great night, folks. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. Kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show, folks. Have a great one. Have a safe one.